Hello, people of the YouTubes. My name is Lizzie. Today is uh, it's 12:46 a.m. So it's Christmas Eve. Um, and you may be wondering what happened to the last three days of the Advent calendar. Well, between life, uh, like social events that came up, um, work, and whatnot, I was real tired and decided to prioritize sleep over getting the video done. So instead of like making one video for every day that I missed, I'm just going to make one big video um, and get this uploaded um, soon because I got stuff I got to do today. Yeah. Well, Merry Christmas to everyone. I don't even remember what we got last time. No clue. We'll find out when I get to the calendar in there. If you hear squeaking, um, I'm in my living room instead of my bedroom filming. Um, and the squeaking is my guinea pigs. So if you hear squeaking, that's just Greg and Bubba saying hi. Okay. Let's get into the last of the calendars. So... What I'm, what I think I'm gonna do, is, I'll still go day by day. <sighs> um, and do then do the the final big reveal of everything we got. Um, but let's get into it because I'm tired and I gotta edit this video. Hello. A little bit different of an angle because I'm not right behind it. I'm off to the side, so the audio might look a little weird. But day 21, let's open up this. And... This one... Yeah, we're just going to build both of these over on Star Wars. It'll just be easier. I just want to get this done. Putting both of those on so it hooks down a little more. Okay. It's a little candy cane clock. That is so cute. I'm gonna go put it on the little stand that all the other stuff is on. And we will build Lego stuff. Let's see if I can get a little better of an angle. That's marginally better. Oop. And stuff is falling everywhere. Um, 
this and this. Ow. Those pieces are pointy. Um, oh, no. Bars. Is it this way? It's hard to tell. I'm assuming so. There we go. I think that's it. Yep. It's one of the um, hover bikes. I think it's really cool. And down onto this isn't one of the platforms you could stand on in it. It is. If I can just get it to work. Okay. There we go. Extra bits go over here. And that was day 21. It's kind of cool. Day 22. Please be the robot. It is. It is the robot. 22 on the camera. Yup. Yup. Yep. Yes, it is. Oh, tore that. Oh. Okay. Okay. Let's see. I just woke up from a nap, so my fingers are way too sensitive to be, like, fighting with these tiny, sharp corners. Um, so, real quick, what we had gotten before my little unintentional hiatus and missing of episodes, we had gotten, um, the, the driller thing, like an industrial driller from, uh, Lego City. Whoop. 
And then I can't remember exactly what the exact name of the ship was right off the top of my head. It's in the description of the last video. But it's um something like a Zeta class cargo ship or something like that. It's some kind of cargo ship. Um which is cool. Let's beat this one. Okay, I got a better idea on how to attach that. There we go. And there we go. Okay. Put a wind up key on the back. The little red things are his arms. There. He has a little accessory thing. Which I'm just going to take the pieces and put together off camera because it's all the sharp, tiny, pointy things and they all hurt. And this is a really bad angle to be dealing with this. Might have to find a better angle. Okay, yeah. Now I don't know what this is supposed to be. Maybe like a battery or something, but it's it's wind up, so I don't know why a wind up robot would need batteries. But I don't know. I have some extras of these green, gray, and blues, so I'm just gonna tack them on there because why not? And now we have a robot. Now I'm going to quickly stop the recording and see if I can find a better angle to record this at. Um, because trying to lean over and assemble these things at this angle because I'm sitting on the floor is a little difficult. So real quick before we build the thing from Star Wars, I'm going to see if I can find a better angle. Okay, <clears throat> this might be marginally better. It's at least better for me because I'm no longer sitting on the floor. So I might have an easier time building things. But probably not.
You know what? I got an idea. I got another one. I'll be right back. This is much better. It's just a, a lot more unstable because this table is not the best. But at least it's not at a weird sharp angle due to the tripod being too tall. And I'm just gonna try to build everything with one hand. Okay. Try not to lose that piece. There we go. Seems like that was focusing weird. Like that, like that. This piece is supposed to be in an angle and I didn't feel like trying to do that with one hand. There we go. This is a Christmas themed moisture evaporator from Luke and Anakin Skywalker's uh, home planet. There we go. This is going to go over with the other stuff. I'm going to use this pip to stick it down over here on the board. And the extra pieces go over in this box. Okay, we're on day 23, I think, which is up here. Okay. Oop. Oop. There we go. 23. When I tear the box, okay. And there we go. In case you're wondering, I am building this in the viewfinder and I can't see really anything. But I'm gonna do my best. Um, how? That hurt. There we go. Come on. Great, 
goes here. Yellow guy. Not this yellow guy. This yellow guy. And that, oh, nope. Stay on there. Please and thank you. And then that yellow guy. Looks like it's just on that side. And then. There. And there we go. We got a helicopter. This is cute. The kind of sad that this doesn't really spin. You can kind of make it spin. But I think we've gotten a helicopter before that did just on its own spin. But it's still cute. Over into the block of stuff that we have gotten. And take the extra pieces out of the way. And let's put together what we got from Star Wars. Pretty easy, it's just a minifigure. Okay, now I think this is General Merrick because he's on the box. I just can't remember what he's from. Um, so the descriptions of everything will, will be in the description box below. What everything's called, what I think of. I will go over like what I eventually think of everything that we've gotten this year. But I think this is our last minifigure. I doubt we're going to get one for the Christmas Eve day. And the 24th. Okay. Just drag this one a little closer. what this is a minifigure of. Let's see what his face looks like. Just generic happy face. I don't know why his hat needs to be in a separate bag. Now, I'm pretty sure, clearly this is Santa, and I'm pretty sure we've gotten a Santa before. Oh, I forgot to put his beard on. Um, but it's still cool. You gotta, you gotta hope to get Santa. You gotta get Santa. You can't have too many Santas. Oh, we got a spare beard. I'm putting that on someone. I don't know who yet, but someone. And his bag, he got a bag of stuff. There. One thing I noticed, he has a candy cane in his belt. That is so cute. So we got Santa and a spear beard. I don't know who I'm gonna put that on, but I'll put him on someone eventually. Yep, come on Santa. Stick to the little plate. Okay. And I'm not moving the camera. We're just gonna build this guy right here. Try not to let his head get away. 
does it put together like I think it does? Yes. Yes, it does. I like the snowman face. I like it. We got a Star Wars themed snowman. He's so cute. Okay, so that's everything so far. That's everything, that's all the calendars, it's all the doors. Ending with a Santa and a snowman. I'm gonna clip him to the little board here and then Here's a little quick pan of everything we got in Lego Star Wars. I am going to set up a little scene with everything. Um, but click, quickly, let's do a run through. I'm actually going to take the camera off the stand and move it. Because it's going to be easier that way. I can put it on my hand and use it properly. There we go. Okay. So we got Luke's Land Speeder, Rose Tico, the Arrowhead, the Republic Fighter Tank, IG-88, Cloud City, Nanaboo Starfighter, the Battle Droid, General Grievous' Starship, a Blaster Cannon, Rowan, Anakin Skywalker's Yellow Starfighter, a Imperial Troop Transport, an Ammo Depot, a Death Trooper, Rathtar, a Guavian security soldier, a TIE fighter, an AT-AT, um, I think it's a Zeta-class cargo ship. We got a hover bike, a Christmas-themed moisture evaporator, General Merrick, and a rebel fighter snowman, who is so cute. I'm going to temporarily put the camera back down. We'll move this off to the side. We'll angle it over this way. And we'll fly in Lego City. Right here. And get some of these extra cords out of the way. And another quick fly across what we got for Lego City. Day one, we got a rocket ship, the boy with nickels, um, the go-kart, the dog with the bull, the sled with the snow that I stuck on top, the snowman with the hot cocoa that didn't want to stay in the mug, the lady with the shovel, the drone, the lamp post with the questionable holly berries, the Goal with the ball, the train, the ice cream machine, the ice cream, the girl with the ice cream, the Christmas presents, Christmas tree, ice cream stand, the baker, the um, Jeep or off-roading vehicle, the RC cars, the driller, the industrial driller, um, candy cane clock, the robot, helicopter, and then finally Santa. So, I'm going to real quick cut this. I'm going to set them up in a little scene in their backdrop here. We'll do a quick hover through that, and then I'll go over what I think of the calendars this year. I will be right back. Okay, so here's the scene I made for Lego City. Not a whole lot of space. But I basically put all the vehicles here, set things up on the little goal thing, presents. I have Santa running the little 
ice cream stand. Baker over there by the ice cream. The little boy with the nickels is there. So yeah. For Lego Star Wars, it wasn't as easy to make a little scene. So I basically just separated them up by what I think was Imperial versus um, the Rebels. The Republic. So... Out of everything from Lego Star Wars, some of my favorites are that battle droid, because I put a scarf on him. I like that Christmas-themed um, moisture evaporator, this snowman, the AT-AT, and the TIE Fighter. Um, the, mini f the Death Trooper is my favorite minifigure out of Star Wars. Out of Lego City... Um, of course I love the robot, and I love the dog, um, the drone's really cool, um, and I think those are actually my favorites. The things that roll, the, the car and the go-kart, the go-kart's pretty cool. So yeah. So in general, I think Lego City was a much better calendar this year. I feel like I wasn't as wowed with Lego Star Wars this year as I was usually. Um, a lot of things that I didn't know what it was, like Rowan and the Arrowhead here, which is from the Freemaker series that I've never heard of. Um, and that thing, which doesn't look anything like what they say it's supposed to look like. Um, and like the Cloud City is like pretty disappointing. But there wasn't really much in Lego City that I thought was disappointing. Like, I wish this spun. But for the most part, I liked both calendars. So, next year I may consider just doing Lego City, but I might do both. We'll have to see. Um, maybe I'll even do the third calendar, but we won't know. I wish you all a very good Merry Christmas. Um, if you celebrate it, if not, I hope you like having a day off if you have one. Um, but I will see you all whenever I make another video. Um, I'm still going to be trying to stream every week. I unfortunately missed su uh, Sunday, so I might do it later in this week. Maybe on Saturday. Um, I will let you all know. And I will see you all in my Lego videos next year. Bye.